evolution of technology is an absolute game changer for the healthcare world. For many decades, hospitals have tried their best to incorporate the use of technology, ranging from the use of electronic data to the multiple electronic storage methods and other technological implementations. However, the healthcare world isn't perfect and many of these current methods are costly and inefficient. In order to find an actual solution, we must identify the current problem that exists, and the list is uncompromisingly long. To start things off, the current use of electronic health records are evidently flawed in many ways. Firstly, paper-based systems are inadequate, and the use of EHRs possess many problems as well. Let's try to understand the primary issue. An EHR is an electronic health record that is systemized in the collection of patient and population health data that is stored in a digital format. It has the ability to capture clinical data, focusing on exchange of healthcare data with other providers and ensuring that patient information flows smoothly on the continuum of care. One of the biggest problems are security risk from criminal computer hackers. Electronic health record software present a tempting target to hackers. Ever since Congress enacted the Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act, organizations with EHRs are required to safeguard sensitive patient information from hackers. The consequences of these types of breaches are serious. You can face lawsuits from patients if their information is compromised. Another risk to keep in mind is the prospect of electronic records being hijacked by crackers who hold the patient data hostage. In addition to this, data bottlenecks are also a problem because of a poorly designed interface. Electronic health records are designed to streamline your workflow, but if the EHR was created by developers with little regard to how it is used in the real-world situation, their interface may be clunky and difficult to work with. This means staff could take much longer than needed to enter basic information or even to retrieve a proper record. Now let's move on to the most common issues with EHRs, data entry. A clinician's work process may make it hard or impossible to appropriately enter the desired EHR data. One case researchers analyzed showed that a clinician chose the wrong frequency for a drug to be administered because the clinician didn't realize that the order in which the options were populated into the EHR had changed. Alerting. Electronic health records alerts other feedback from systems are sometimes inadequate because they are absent, incorrect, or ambiguous. For example, a report showed that even though a patient's gelatin allergy was listed in the electronic health record, a clinician wasn't alerted to the allergy while prescribing a medicine. Interoperability. Communication of information in an EHR may be hindered because interoperability is inadequate within components of the same EHR or from other EHRs in other systems. In one case, clinicians couldn't access labs for a hospital patient from records held in a different part of the hospital. Virtual display. Clinicians may find it hard to interpret information because EHR displays are confusing, cluttered, or inaccurate. For example, a clinician tried to order 3.125 mg of a medication, but the electronic record only listed 6.25 mg, with a 3.125 mg dose listed in small print, confusing the clinician. Workflow support. The electronic health record workflow is not supposed to be due to a mismatch between the record and the user's intent. In one case, a physician ordered diagnostic tests and included instruction for the lab in a special instruction field, not knowing that the lab staff couldn't see that information. Consequently, the tests weren't conducted. Availability of information. Clinically relevant information is hindered because it is entered or stored in the wrong location. For example, a hospital lab staffer couldn't access a section of the patient's health record with a clinician ordered diagnostic test. Consequently, the tests weren't performed. System automation and defaults. The electronic health record automates or defaults to information that is unexpected, unpredictable, or not transparent to the clinician. For example, a clinician ordering an anticoagulant tried to start the dosing at a setting time, but the date automatically defaulted to the following day. Since we are able to identify most areas of problems within the electronic health records and interoperability, we can now innovate a solution to all these problems. A revolutionary design and prototype made for the future of healthcare. This is AI12, a program that is extraordinarily powerful and precise. Designed to do the impossible by implementing quicker and more efficient methods of healthcare storage and data.
The hardware and software are optimized to the max. AI14 Bionic has the most powerful core yet, powering on an Intel Core i7-10700K. AI12 has the best data analyzing ability. This machine can obtain and process data while reducing costs and internet waste. AI12 has outstanding machine learning capabilities. The machine can learn and generate ICD-9 and ICD-10 codes, as well as catch any human errors that anyone may miss. The storage and memory on this machine is phenomenal. AI-12 can assist in COVID-19 data as well as store and process data in disease mitigation during the current pandemic. An integral part of this prototype is the machine's ability to revolutionize and improve healthcare in a safety manner. Security is one of the strongest encryptions in this machine and will change the healthcare world tremendously. And this is AI-12, the most powerful healthcare innovation.